हेलो फ्रेंड्स इन टूडेज क्लास वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड विथ डिस्क स्केड्यूलिंग एल्गोरिथम सो वेलकम यूर एंड दिस इज द फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन इट सेज दैट कंसिडर डिस्क विथ हंड्रेड सिलेंडर्स द रिक्वेस्ट टू एक्सेस द सिलेंडर ऑकर्स इन द फॉलोइंग सीक्वेंस assuming that the head is currently at 50 at cylinder 50 uh, what is the time taken to satisfy all the request if it takes 1 millisecond to move from one cylinder to adjacent one and the shortest seek time first uh, policy is used okay and the shortest seek time right now this cylinder is at uh, 50 and uh, now i i best think that we can do is we can short it out okay so just a sorted order with 2 4 and then i think 7 uh then okay 6 is there 6 7 and 7 more than 7 is 10 then more than 10 is uh, 15 then we have a 20 uh, anything else 19 and then we have a 20 and then directly i think we have 34 34 and then we have 34 34 34 34 more than 34 is uh, i think nothing that is 73 okay let me just count 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and 10 fine so now, shortest seek uh, so you are at 50 and the shortest one in this case will be Uh, here you have seventy three, and then you have thirty four. So that is going to move thirty four. Thirty four. Then the shortest one will be shortest will be uh, that is going to serve the cylinder twenty and twenty. Then you can move to one more nineteen. Okay, and then nineteen you can move to fifteen, and then you can go to ten. then you can go to 7 then you can move to 7 then 6 and then 4 and then you can move to 2 and after that uh, only one is left that is your uh, 73 so directly i'll move to 73 moment so moments will be uh, 50 to 6 34 that will be 16 moments and then we have a 20 so that will be 14 then we have a 19 so we have only one okay uh right 19 is the 19 to 15 we have four moment 15 to 10 we have five moment uh 10 to 7 we have three moment 7 to 6 we have one 6 to 4 we have two and 4 to 2 we have only uh Two and finally we have two to seventy three. That is seventy one moments. Adding it up, so that is thirty, thirty one, thirty five, thirty five, thirty five, and then forty, forty three, forty four, forty eight. Okay, and forty eight and seventy one. That is equal to one one nine. And since it is taking one millisecond, so I'll just multiply this one millisecond, and that will become one one nine. millisecond and that goes with answer b okay so for this question answer is b the next question okay and now we have a disk with 201 cylinders 201 cylinders and we are having 0 to 200 at some time the disk arm it as 100 okay thus disk arm it as 100 and there is a queue of disk access request from the cylinder 30 sorted order uh, then 30 then we have what anything no oh, then we have 85 and then we have 90 then we have 100 then we have 105 and then we have 110 and then we have 135 and then we have 145 okay now it is at 
the question is that uh, if uh, shortest seek time is being used for scheduling then disk access the request of 90 will be serviced after blank number of request how many requests it will serve before it's serving the 90 so right now you are at 100 and after 100 uh, the shortest one is 105 uh, shortest one is 110 then the next 110 is 135 here and another one is 885 so here the disk movement will be uh, 25 and here the disk movement will be uh, okay uh, next one is uh, here is 90 actually sorry for this this is 25 okay this uh, this will take 25 and and here it will take uh, only 20 so now we'll go with this 90 20 so after how many request okay after how many uh, the question is that uh, the request 90 is 90 will be serviced after how many uh, Okay, if the shortest seek time is uh, scheduling is used, then the request for the cylinder 90 is serviced after servicing number of requests. Okay, so right now you are at uh, 100, as it mentioned, that so you are serving a, a 1, 2, and then 3, and after that 90, the so answer, answer for this question will be 3. Okay, after 3 requests, it, it will be serviced. Okay, now suppose we, uh, this is the next question from... Uh, which says that suppose the following disk request uh, sequence uh, with the disk of 100 tracks is there uh, and uh, assume that the initial head position is 50 okay and the additional distance uh, will be traversed by the read write head when shortest seek time first algorithm is used compared to the scan elevator algorithm assume that scan algorithm moves to 100 when start execution is blank track additional okay okay so now here uh, okay now we uh, first of all shortest seek time so the minimal here in this case will be 10 uh, 10 and then 20 and then you have 25 right 25 greater than 25 and then you have in, I think 20 25 and then you have 45 and then after 45 you are having 50 and then after 50 we are having 60 and then you are having 70 Okay, and then we have 70, then we are having 80, and then we are having 90. Okay, I guess so it's done 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. I think one more must be there 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Okay, fine, we're done. So from 50, if I'm using the shortest seek time first, then from 50, I'm going to move shortest seek time is one side is 45, another side is 60. I'll go for 60. And then we'll go to 70. Then we'll go to 80. Then we'll go to 90. After that 90, we are having the shortest seek time as 45. So it will move back to here with 45 request. Then definitely we have a shorted order. So it will be 25. Uh, then it will be moved to 20 and then it will move to 10 okay so the movement here in this case is uh, for stsf shortest seek time first the movement is what 10 10 20 30 40 and then we have all the way 45 that make it 85 85 plus 20 105 105 plus 5 Zero five, eighty five plus twenty one zero five one zero five plus five. It will become one hundred and ten, and this is twenty. Okay, so let me just uh, one more time. So ten, 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 twenty, and then seventy to seventy, ten, twenty, thirty, forty. And then all the way 92, uh, we will move to this uh, 45, that is your 85. And from 80, 45, we'll move to 25. 
looks correct okay that is 20 movement 25 to 20 we have 5 movement and 25 20 to there it's 10 so 10 20 30 40 40 85 85 plus 5 90 so i'm getting 120 as my movement in this okay 120 movements okay so that is your uh, okay it's not correct so here we are having a, a, a disk uh, suppose the following disk request for a disk block of 100 tracks and it is given as uh, uh, given here in this case is uh, uh, let me write here in sorted order 10 and then we have 10 then we have 20 then we have 25 then we have 45 then we have 50 uh, 50 then we are having 60 then we are having 70 then we are having 80 and then we have a 90 and here we are having a tracks at 50 okay and the shortest seek time will first will go to 45 right and then 45 to 25 is 20 and 45 to 60 is 15 that will go to 60 and then it will go to 70 then it will go to 80 then it will go to 90 from 90 all the way it will go to next request the shortest request will be 25 so it will move to 25 and then 25 to 20 there will be 5 head movement and then 20 to 10 it will be 10 so this will become 5 uh, this will become 15 put me let me put in a different color 5 20 30 40 50 and then this movement will be a uh, 65 so uh, 5 20 30 40 50 and then it will be 65 that will be 115 and that is 5 120 and 130 the plus 15 the total movement is 130 in which case in case of stsf shortest seek time first okay uh, the next request uh, there is your scan algorithm that will move toward the head 100 and we are at 50 uh, let me use all together different color for this uh, let me put it on black so now this is 50 and now the head will move to the 100 track so it will move to this 60 then it will move to 70 then to move to 80 then it will move to 90 then finally it will move to the boundary that is your 100 okay and from that 100 now it will go back scan algorithm and it will start serving you know everything that was in serving it back so now first it will serve 45 then it will serve 25 then it will serve 20 and finally it will serve 10 so the head movement in this case will be 10 let me put in a red so this will become 10 20 30 40 and this become 50 this direction 100 to 45 is 55 okay 55 to 25 is 20 20 then 5 and then 10 then 5 and then 10 total head movement so 105 105 120 105 110 130 and total head movement is 140 now here we are getting 130 and here we are getting 140 and it is saying saying that when the shortest seek time algorithm is used compared to scan algorithm the additional distance additional distance traveled so there is no additional distance travel in this case okay no additional distance travel and the only thing that is what is doing is taking 10 tracks less 10 tracks less so additional distance answer should be here uh, what should write here to, it might be confusing you but uh, there is no additional distance uh, so the correct answer should be i think no additional distance okay and uh, if i go by strictly by this then i'll say zero additional distance even minus 10 is the additional distance in negative quantity
okay so that is the answer for this question now consider the next question is there and uh, it is from uh, one of the latest paper consider the following five disk uh, five disk access request uh, of the form a request id cylinder number and that present in the disk scheduler queue at the given time so p155 and 85 110 30 nt id is also given to assume that head is po position at the cylinder 100 so we are at 100 position okay 100 now the schedule scheduler follows the shortest seek time which of the following is false we need to find so shortest seek time 100 100 and then the next higher number is 110 and the next lower no 110 so now it will go to acha let me just short it out uh, 30 and then we have 85 uh, then we have uh, 110 and then we have one one five and then we have uh, one fifty five and disk is at hundred okay so now here in this case the shortest distance will be from hundred that will be only ten moment so one one zero and then one one zero to one one five 115 to the next request is at 40 and the previous request is at 30 so now it will go to all the way and service 85 85 to the next distance is of 50 okay 85 to this is 50 and the above one is 70 so it will definitely go into service 30 and that will make it last request as sorry for this Last request will be for 155. Okay, so here uh, let me put the IDs that uh, 110 is having ID R, 115 is having ID T, 85 is having ID Q, and 30 is having ID as S, and 115 has the ID T. Okay, so we have to comment about the this uh, that Q is serviced after s no q is not serviced after s q is serviced before s the first statement is false the head reverse uh, its direction of movement movement uh, before servicing q and p before servicing q and p uh, where is p uh, p is 155 oh sorry this is p so before serving Q and P, it reverses the direction. So this is uh, the head reverses its direction, direction of movement between servicing Q and P. So between servicing Q and P, yes, it is reversing. So this is true. R is service before P. R is service before P. Yes, true. And T is serviced before P. T is serviced before P. This is also. So answer for this question is A that Q is serviced after S. Okay, Q is serviced after S. Okay, so that is all for the discussion of this gate questions and uh, uh, you can identify the shortest seek time and scan is being stressed a lot in this uh, gate question discussion. Okay, so that's all for this discussion. Thank you.